What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2023 Bowman Draft Jumbo sold out. This is Pikachu number four, guys. So, let's switch on over. And these customers, their little character signs got him from the filler, paying a fraction of the price. And some guys actually won. What the freak was? <clears throat> Don't make me change that name to, to Rex Pizzle on this sheet. Or mistakenly shipped them to Rex. <laughs> Bro, you guys couldn't even beat the Lakers, dog. I don't know what y'all talking about, man. What I see right now, even after today's loss, Thunder are still number three. This is where I see. This is where I see Phoenix, though. Right now, this is where I see the Thunder. So. Exactly. It's still early, because that's what I'm saying, man. Might even be higher later in the year. Oh, let's try on the highlights right now. Yeah, it looks like Fox was the main guy. It just says SGA was the Thunder. Damn, the Thunder were down at like 15 points at one point. They came back. Especially with SGA. Jesus Christ. All right, here we go, guys. Dun, 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 dun. Vrandenburg. Oh. <laughs> Man, Pizzle just taking shots right now. <laughs> Blast, Bryce Eldridge. Trust with that one. Woo! How about a Jacob Wilson Green color match? Sixth overall pick out of Thousand Oaks, California. Sunshine, he from California. There you go. A's. Go to Matt Arnold. Who got them from that filler. We got Weniger.
Quiet. Salmon. And we got it to Mar Johnson at 125. Wow, the Columbus Blue Jack I mean the the Maple Leafs were down five nothing and they came back. Oh, uh, Blue Jackets won in overtime though. Damn, it sucks. What a comeback though. Woo! How about little Drew Jones for Copperman. Man, it's been your day, Copperman. 33 out of 99. How many Drew Jones autographs have you gotten in person before Joe Pizzle? Ethan O'Donnell. On the board. That's the first auto Pizzle. Usually the first stack has nothing. That's the second autograph there. The third's going to be in the other stack right there. Uh, Pizzle. With the Reds. Wyatt. And I want to say, actually, I think Ethan O'Donnell. No, no, that's not him. It's a different one. There's a Red that's a first round pick. I just forget which one it is. And for the Rays, Adrian Santana raises Mark. Jaden Ham. Oh, that's right, Rhett. Good box, but not a bad box, I guess. I mean, Drew Jones. But we're just started, guys. We just started. found anything Rex and I think they're just trying to just make sure it just goes under under anybody's radar and then randomly just gonna announce that we didn't find anything and he's reinstated but it just tarnished his whole career though the Bills Hunter did, right? That news came out and then boom, cut him. Out of the league. 
and then what happened? Can't always believe what you see on social media. Especially nowadays. I'm not saying that those photos are all AI shit, but fuck. I've even fell for fucking AI photos. Spencer Nevins for the Rolls and Pizzle. Eldridge. Jacob Wilson. Cole Schwoenwetter to 199. Pizzle. It's just eating. He eating. Munch, munch, munch. <laughs> nice. And a Matt Shaw speckle. Not numbered though, but still pretty nice. Enrique Bradfield Jr. Nice one there. Oros, that's going to Jake. Blake Mitchell Refractor. He's a top prospect, too. Colt Emerson. Skeens. Cole Miller. In our 20 caser, we hit a mood ring um, Mariners dude, Colt Emerson, out of five. Autograph, too. The show was nuts. Moon rings, I think. Mood ring is a moon rings. I think I thought it was moon. Mood, but maybe moon. Two more autographs here, man. Hold pole. And a Tommy Troy for the Dynamics. Going to Cup. Cup. Is he really? He doesn't like to sign for you? Oh, Speckle. 
Wyatt Langford. Speckle. That's to 71. Thirty-eight out of seventy-one. Let's go, baby. Yeah, he should have went there. Anytime I think of Tommy Troy, I think of Tommy Trojan. Dun, da, 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 da. Dun, 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 dun. I always love their band though, man. Their band is freaking sick. So this is an iconic fight song right there. Yeah, I think Langford, I think, is the number one player in this draft, for sure. He's, he's at the top of everybody's cheat sheets, draft boards. Ahuna. Alright, here we go. Third box. You think you would hold him, for sure? I mean, you know more than anybody else, because you get to see these guys all the time. I mean, when does he? When do they expect him to get called up? Born in two thousand and one, fourth overall pick. Went to college, right? I mean, damn, his college stats are wild. Twenty-one home runs, fifty-seven RBIs, slugging percentage seven eighty-four, with an average of three seventy-three. OPS one point two eight two. Damn. Yeah, because he's a little bit on the older side now, right? He's like 22, 23 now. It's crazy because there is going to be a couple of these players that are in this in this draft that will get probably called up by next year, huh? Oh, and finally, dude, right? I remember you told me about that like a year or two ago, dude. Finally starting it? That's sick, man. You know, they're building a Hard Rock resort. They're building a Hard Rock uh, in downtown Long Beach, man. They just announced that uh, like two weeks ago. Yeah, it's like the first, first like, you know, uh, high rise to be built in a while. But yours is gonna be a casino, though, right? I don't think this one's gonna be a casino. This one's just gonna be like a resort. Let's see. Yeah, so they're going to build a hotel build in Long Beach. First one in a while. It's supposed to break ground in 2024. <laughs> For real, dude. Now, if they make gambling illegal, uh, illegal eventually, that'd be awesome in California. Dump it on some parlays there. Kevin Parada. <laughs> Zantanello.
Favor, Jackson Ballmister. And a purple, Drew Gilbert. Dude, you get so much more color in Jumbo than you do Super Jumbo. It's crazy. Alright, Jace Boreffen. Boreffen. It's 99. Blue Jays, Matt Arnold. Ooh. Ooh. Another one. Mood rings. Paul Skeens. I get an autograph of that guy right there like that. Oh. Jonah Cox. He must be left handed because he's signing it to the left. Out of 199. Cox. Yeah, a nice Cox right there. Nice Cox. How big how, how is that Cox? It's pretty nice. 6'2, maybe? Yeah. Six, six foot three. Six foot three? Yeah. Decent sized Cox. Matt Arnold loves that Cox. He has the he has the A's. <laughs> <laughs> he has the A's. <laughs> Was it? Josue de Paula. Dylan Head. Padres. That's going to Henry. Dodgers, they keep it Manny Margot, right? You think they're going to keep him? Do you, do you think they would keep him? Or would he be part of another trade package? If Could be. That's the case. But I think he's a righty, and like Hayward's like a lefty, so I think they would put two True. I guess I guess that kind of makes sense. And I think their splits are better that way too. Yeah. I want I would have wanted Randy in there. They probably would have yeah. to give him more, huh? Yeah, Randy Arizona is probably like Cunningham. That's like maybe Bobby Miller level. Yeah, I know, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> y'all are y'all are nasty. You're lucky it's past people's bedtimes. Alright, next box, guys. Halfway through.
All right, next box. Yeah, you know what's crazy? They have this dude working for ESPN. Have you noticed that? The secondary announcer for the Dodgers. Charlie Soto. Who? Um, who's the who's the Asian broadcaster that they hired? Uh, the one who has a good voice, oh, too? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He works for ESPN, too. He does, like, some of the nights on ESPN. Oh. To 150. That's right. He does, doesn't he? Yeah. He was on MLB Network. Yeah. So I don't I know if he's, he's just... I don't think he's with MLB Network anymore. He's just getting, keeping busy or maybe... What's that guy's name? I forget. He was in, he, he was in getting interviewed earlier at Dodger Stadium, too. Steven Nelson, that's Steven right. Steven Nelson, yeah, that's, that's right. right. I think he's from Soap. He's an L.A. guy. Yeah. Well, it's probably easy for him right now to just kind of do some ESPN until baseball season, and then he only does, like, half the season, right? Because whenever Joe can't really do it. Not then, even half. Maybe, like. Yeah, maybe actually even less than maybe that. Maybe even less, so. Yes. Whenever Joe Davis does like the Fox National games, mm -hmm. yeah, then, he, like, he does football on Sunday. College football. Yeah, he does college football too. That's right. Tommy yeah. Troy. It's like September, right? Yeah. Christopher Torin. Paper Josue de Paula for the Dodgers to 50. Um, so for personal boxes on Fanatics, yeah. the person's not there. Do we just do it because we'd have replays? Or should I hold? I would. He's not there. I would probably yeah, ship. I, I would. Oh, okay. I would. Uh, I would ship it sealed. Oh, but I'm. I'm but I mean, I guess you could rip it and he could watch the replay, right? I guess you're right. I, I guess it doesn't really matter. I don't think he'd be upset if you ripped it. I don't think so either. So yeah, maybe just do it, it and then if he asks, he'd be like, "Oh yeah, we ripped it," even though you know. Right here. And then you can watch the replay. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, because we have a replay now, so I you guess that's skip true. all the way to the end. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Max Anderson. Out of four ninety nine. That Gavin crossed the one fifty. It's going to Pizzo. Two more autographs hiding in here somewhere. And Christian. We'll call him Nap. Napsky? It's a 250 for the Guardians. Going to Brian. Waldrip to four ninety nine. Nappy hat. <laughs> and then Tommy Hawk, the best name in the draft. I hit a super factor earlier. Guardians box right there, man. Clark Refractor.
Alright, 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 alright. How we doing guys? How we doing? Half people fall asleep already? Halfway through folks, halfway through. That would be sick, huh? Who was the first to do that? So I feel like I heard that first like in Florida State. Because Florida State does it. The Atlanta Braves do it. The Kansas City Chiefs do it. Got to figure, I guess it's Florida State because of the marching battle, right? So the Chiefs are posers. They're just like, we could do it too. That's a Rose Gold Jackson Ballmister. Rose is going to Jake. Noble Meyer. Spackle Jet Williams. How about that Raider Charger game earlier, guys? Like, how do you see that game and not want to fire the head coach? And poor head coach, man. Four Staley. He has to answer all these questions of like, do you think they still want you to be your head coach? Do you think you're going to get fired? <laughs> Yeah, Chargers had no Herbert, no Keenan Allen. You know, they've lost so many close games, anyways. But but yeah, that's wild. Wild. Cooper Angle for the Guardians. Brian with that one. Seth Keener. <laughs> we did it, Joe. We did it. Uh, 
and Moraldus. All right, we need to we need to pick it up. We kind of in a little slump right now with these boxes. We need to pick it up, guys. Carson Reed. Continue on. Emmett Olsen for Miami. Going to Denise. Sounds like a Rex problem, Rex. <laughs> Tommy Troy! Are you sure it's just not your like 1995 Windows? It's just not loading it? <laughs> Using like Netscape as a web browser? <laughs> Yeah, definitely let, definitely talk to Pizzle about that. <laughs> Pizzle will gladly give you all the conspiracy theories of, <laughs> yeah, it's just it's fanatics. <laughs> They're just out to get you. They just want to make it harder for the consumer. That's how they became one of the biggest companies in America. Kendall George is 75. Remember how Pizzle was like, there's no Brady Autos in HTA. Yeah. <laughs> Because it's fanatics. They're just looking to screw the little guy. All righty. Let's see an autograph now. I don't know. I'm just joking with you, Rex. I'm sure it's fanatics. Or uh, the site. To one ninety nine. And Jack Hurley. Wait, how long has it been, Rex? It's been a couple days, I think, for that redemption site. And there's like no statement from Tops? No emails to their customers? Hey. <laughs> a quality control mess up and put one in HTA where they'll know. Oh, we want an HTA. Right, right, right. This is, this is classic conspiracy theory. It's just like, oh, you just keep moving the goalposts. It's like, oh, well, it's only one, though. 
Yeah. It's only one. There was a shooter on the grassy knoll. Right, right, right. Oh, there was in, inside the bush. They, they prove it wrong. It's like, well, no. Then it was the other one. Well, that's what they want you to think. <laughs> you know, this is this is this is how QAnon stuff happens. Anything to continue the, continue the narrative. Oh, uh, so funny. Well, just to continue the narrative. Boyd, Morris. I love you, Pizzle. How convenient for Rex, huh? The, the freaking day you get your redemption, the website's not working. <laughs> Dude, such bad timing, too. Woo! Blue! Luke Kayshaw. Number 150. Well, this definitely looks like cropped in. <laughs> one off one with a few boxes. Is that from a fresh case? Yeah, there might be some in the locker for someone to check. Uh, no, lo no locker. Oh, then maybe. Maybe. Oh, we got a block. Atlanta Braves. Hurston Waldron. I love the black ones, man. It looks so sick. 75 out of 75. <laughs> Rex, is over, uh, Rex is over here thinking like oh, Thank god Pizzle's here He'll be on my side <laughs> Spoiler alert It's like that one friend where, you know, Rex is talking about he's seen aliens and he, you, you, you know that he's right, but then he's telling all these other popular guys like, Rex was, uh, Joe Pizzle was there, right? Right, Pizzle, you believe me? And they're like, I don't know what you're talking about, bro. You crazy, dude. I see some red, baby? Oh, might not be autographed, though. Might just be color. Up the colors, Joe Pizzle, so maybe that is ours. We needed that though, man. This, these boxes are starting to get a little, a little too soft right here. All right, here we go, guys. We're just gonna start off wire with the red. Just gonna do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Whoa, does this have an autograph or is that a facsimile? Yankees, Roderick Arias, 53 out of 54. I thought that was red. It is red though, right? 
I guess red in the 54 is not the same. I don't think that's autographed. Huh? Looks like a facsimile. It's the 54 flag insert, but I thought it would be out of five, bro. How's that? It's just trolling me, man. Nonetheless, hit for Matt Smith. Camden right there. Chase Davis. What if that was stamped wrong and it should have been at a five? Green, Lucas Gordon for the Sox. Jeremy Taylor. See green coming up here. We're not green. Willenberg off. The Phillies. Ooh. Ooh, Garrett Forrester. Class of 2023 autographs. Number to 99 for the Pittsburgh Pirates. Pirates going to Chad. Should have two autographs in this stack. Zach Levinson for the Cardinals going to Josh. And Daniel Carrico. Evans, Jacob Wilson. All right, guys, last box.
Spencer Pye O'Halloran. It's a four ninety nine. Spaggle Woodward. Bruce Omar. We got Enrique Bradfield Jr. And Rhett Louder to 99 Green Grass. I think that's their first round of because it's seventh overall. Nice. Let's get some ink on this kid. Talk about that right now, then, man. They go Piz. They go Piz. Now you can get him to sign it in person. <laughs> now I don't know if this, he doesn't. The, the, the Reds are not on this side, huh? Oh, they are. Oh. All right, two more, uh, sorry, three autographs coming up, guys. First one's going to be in this stack. Last two in the last stack. Justin Crawford to 150. All right, baby, come on. Give me a nice one here. Sean <coughs> Sullivan for the Rockies. Going to Cup. Stack here, guys. And a green Cade Denton for the Rockies. Copperman. And Hunter Holland for the Reds, for Pizzle. Third rounder, 74th overall. All right, well, I feel like I've seen better cases, although this one did have a monster early on. But still some solid stuff popping out here. A lot of nice color, actually. And that's the beautiful part of Jumbo that I like, guys. This year's Jumbo has a ton of nice color. So, definitely makes up for some of the hits that you don't get in autographs. Um, let's do a quick little recap before I close this video. All right, guys, so let me talk about this, and then we'll do a recap.
All right, so we got a bunch of these ones here, guys. The glass actually sell pretty well. Some of these I've seen them sell for as high as like 40, 50 bucks. Anywhere from 10 to 40, 50. So these definitely do add up. It's a noble mare, which are nice. Then obviously tons of color, but we'll just kind of go through the bigger cards with autographs. So there's that Red Louder, Levinson, Rigo, Sullivan, Den, Holland, Forrester, there's that Red, Rotor Garias, Walter Black, the 75 K Shell, Keener, Marodas, Hurley, uh, Cooper Angle. Uh, then we got a Baumister to 10 Rose Gold, Tommy Hawk, Nepsick, Anderson, Jonah Cox, Dylan Head, Cunningham, Mood Ring Schemes, Shaw. Miller, Tommy Troy. Did you get that Wyatt Langford, which is a big one, man? O'Donnell, Santana, Drew Jones. But I feel like we were... I feel like I've seen a lot better, though. That's that's the one thing I'm just trying to say. So, again, the next case is in the store. Look out for it to be discounted or put in a filler, guys. Thank you guys so much. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.